In this video, I will show you when analyzing multiple data sets, how to set in Origins Report Sheets an appropriate identifier for your data. Here we're looking at sensor data, 1, 2, and 3. Notice the long name and units are the same in each worksheet. However, the worksheet name is unique with the sensor number. We're going to go ahead and perform a linear regression on the data plotted here. I choose Analysis, Fitting, Linear Fit, and open up the dialog. I want to change my input data to include all the plots. And then I want an independent fit, but a consolidated report. So I go ahead and click OK. We're going to switch to the report sheet. And then look at the parameters table here. It just says sensor output, so it's using the long name, and it combined that because it was the same. But now we have no way of properly knowing which data set the intercept and slope are for in this case. So I can right click anywhere here, choose data set identifier from the context menu, and then change this to sheet name. The parameters table updates correctly identifying now the intercept and sloped for sensors 1, 2, and 3. Of course, we could have done this from the start, too. So if I were to reopen, I'm going to left click on the lock and go to Change Parameters. Initially, when I had performed the analysis and the Linear Fit dialog opened, I could have expanded the Output Settings branch, and there's a Data Set Identifier option right here. Now it's picking up sheet name because that's what we had specified. You can choose from short name, long name units. You can also choose custom, which allows you to enter in a combination of multiple options, such as the long name, worksheet name. So you have complete control there. This option is available from other dialogues as well. Any analysis that's going to create a consolidated report sheet. This concludes this presentation. Thank you for watching.